The first thing we need to do is open our IDE. Here I'm using PyCharm and we need to install a few modules for this program. So we're going to open the terminal and type pip3 install pyinput, which will tell the program whether the user has typed YouTube. And then pip3 install pyotagui, which is going to tell the program if it sees the YouTube logo on the screen. And now we're ready to code. So we're going to import the things we just installed. So from pyinput.keyboard, import key, listener, and controller, and then import pyotagui. Now we're going to make a list called keys, which stores what keys the user has pressed. So keys equals square brackets, and then keyboard equals controller, so that later we can control the keyboard. Now we're going to make a function which is going to record what keys are being pressed, which resets every time you hit enter. So def on press key, and then global keys so that we can access our list, and then if key equals key dot enter, so when enter is pressed, then we want to empty our list. So keys equals square brackets. After this conditional, we put keys.append key to add the key to the list. Now what we need before emptying our list is another function that checks if YouTube was typed. We're going to call this process keys. And now we can call this from our on press function. Now in our process keys, we need to put all the letters in our list together. And we can do this with a list comprehension. So recent keys equals speech marks dot join string keys dot and then replace the single speech marks with nothing and then for key and keys and dot lower. Now we can check if YouTube was typed. So if YouTube in recent keys, then we want to see if the YouTube logo has appeared on the screen. So if locate on screen, and then we need to take a screenshot of the YouTube logo. Now bear in mind, this takes into account of the size of the image too. So don't zoom in and don't take a screenshot from the internet. Now I'm going to name this YouTube logo and drag it into my project. And now we can type in YouTube logo.png and confidence equals 0.8 so that we're at least 80% sure that this is the image. Then we're going to want to close the tab, which we can do with the keyboard command control or command W. So keyboard dot press key command or key control if you're on Windows, then keyboard dot press W keyboard.release w and finally keyboard.release key command and to tie it all up we need to add the listener to call these functions so with listener on press equals on press as listener listener dot join now we can test our code and it looks like we have an error saying we need opencv so back in our terminal we need to type pip3 install opencv python now let's try it again so now i'm going to type youtube and hit enter and it closes 